In this video, we'll show the process of how to properly connect and configure communications on the SolarEdge Commercial Gateway. This video was recorded in a closed training environment. Refer to the manual and adhere to your company's safety practices while in the field. While the cover is on the gateway, several terminals and ports are accessible. For communications, the RJ45 port as well as the RS485 1 and 2 termination blocks. With the cover removed from the gateway, you could connect a commercial cellular plug-in. To connect an Ethernet cable, connect the Ethernet cable to the RJ45 port. To set the server connection to LAN, long hold on the Enter button and then enter the password 123-123-12. Scroll down to Communications and press Enter. Select Server and press Enter. Select LAN and press Enter. To connect RS-485 for leader or follower communications, connect the communication conductors for B, A, and G connections to the RS-485 termination block. Be sure to use a twisted pair for B and A and the conductor of your choice for G. Once the conductors are secure, reconnect the termination block to the gateway. In most cases, the commercial gateway will act as a leader device in the RS-485 bus. To set up RS-485 communications, Long hold on enter and use the password 123-123-12. From the menu, scroll down to Communications and press Enter. Scroll down to your RS-485 interface configuration and press Enter. Select Device Type, press Enter. Select Solar Edge, press Enter. Next, scroll down and select Protocol, then select Master. Once set, scroll down to Slave Detect and press Enter. Change the No to a Yes using either arrow button and press Enter. The gateway will now look for inverters connected to it on the RS-485 bus. Once connection is complete, scroll to the Slave List to verify serial numbers of the inverters connected to the gateway. To connect the cellular commercial plug-in, first connect the antenna extension to the plug-in. Next, carefully remove the cover of the gateway. Line up the pins on the cellular plug-in with the connections on the gateway and gently depress to secure. Route the antenna cable through the cutout on the top cover. Next, connect the antenna extension to the antenna. To set server connection to cellular, long hold on the enter button and then enter the password 123-123-12. Scroll to communications and press enter. Select server and press enter. Select cellular and press enter. Finally, exit the menus and then verify SOK. Thanks for joining us today. Please be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more helpful videos.